Turned out to be a pretty nice day today, right? Sunshine, temperatures in the 50s, not bad for December. It is going to change by the time we hit the tail end of the weekend, but in the short term, uh, not a whole lot is going to change. So it's a nice evening out there. 54 degrees still at BWI, even as we head towards sunset. A light southeast wind at 8 miles per hour. Temperatures elsewhere, upper 40s and low 50s. The temperatures will eventually drop back into the 30s overnight tonight, so it's going to get seasonably cold overnight tonight, but this evening, uh, maybe just a light jacket, but if you're out late tonight, it will feel cold. Nothing to talk about here in the mid-Atlantic, at least for right now, and that tells me at least through tomorrow, the weather is not going to change much, but this little storm system here looks innocent, doesn't look like much, but this is going to turn into a big storm over on the East Coast and produce all that uh, unsettled weather we were discussing at the beginning of the show. So let's take a look at this on our future cast and we'll time it out for you. This is tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. Should start out uh, fairly quiet, but again, the temperatures will be in the 30s with a few scattered clouds. It's going to be nice in the afternoon. If you have outdoor plans this weekend, pick Saturday as opposed to Sunday. Uh, Saturday should be pretty nice. Mix of sun and clouds with temperatures in the 50s. And then as we head into Saturday night and early Sunday morning, that storm will approach from the west. Now, early Sunday morning, I don't think there'll be a whole lot of heavy rain around, just scattered showers. So if you have stuff to do on Sunday, the earlier in the day, the better, because by the time we get into the afternoon, some heavy rain is going to develop. There could even be some thunderstorms around Baltimore and some flooding rain is possible. One to three inches of rain. The heaviest rain will be late in the afternoon and evening. This is our future cast at three o'clock. We set the time frame into the evening and it looks like the rain's going to continue eight, nine o'clock. It'll still be raining pretty hard. But then a cold front's going to go through and the temperatures are going to crash after midnight. And it looks like that cold air is going to catch up to the rain. This is our future cast for 3 o'clock in the morning on Monday. A lot of snow, especially in the western suburbs. And the temperatures will stay above freezing, but I do think there's going to be some minor accumulations north and west of I-95. We'll keep an eye on that. That just depends on how quickly the cold air moves in. But don't be surprised if you see a little snow on the ground after being near 60 on Sunday. On Monday morning, there could be a little snow. Clear to partly cloudy tonight. Temperatures drop back into the 30s. Sunset coming up in about a half an hour. During the day tomorrow, mixture of sunshine and clouds. Going to be a nice day. The high temperatures will range between 52 and 57. Seven day forecast going through the weekend. That uh, bumpy weather on Sunday. Early morning snow possible on Monday. Then it should clear up. Now the rest of the week is going to be fine. It'll be a little bit chilly. The normal high is around 50. It'll be in the 40s with overnight lows in the 20s and 30s, but it should stay dry all the way into the end of the week. On Friday, temperature may get back up close to 50.